Hello and welcome back to the Symmetry YouTube channel. My name is Craig Snell, the training and support manager here at Symmetry. And today we're going to have a look at using layers in AutoCAD and more specifically using the layer walk function. Very powerful tool and along with many things that we're talking about on this channel, very much underused. I hope you enjoy it. A major pain point for many, many people inside of AutoCAD is layers. A lot of people know how to use them, a lot of people don't, a lot of people think they know how to use them. And one of the biggest problems with it is that people put things in the wrong layer and they were working with a specific layer and they carried on drawn and changed and didn't change and things up ended up on the wrong layer. So when we look at this drawing, as you can see here, all things are different colours, which is great. Um, I have my layer set up, great, and everything looks right, but is it? So yes, you can go through and I can click on that and say, all right, that's on the dimensions layer, and that's on the dimensions layer, that's great. Everything else is going to be fine, isn't it? Um, if we have a quick look at this one though, if we look at this one, you see, I've, even though it's the same colour, I've actually put it on the wrong layer, so that's on the viewports layer, and obviously it should be on the dimensions layer. Now. You can't really go through a drawing of this size or even something smaller or even larger would be terrible. You can't go through and see um, by clicking on each individual entity to see what layer it's on. So we're going to use a wonderful tool. It used to be part of the Express Tools but is now part of the product called Layer Walk. So if we um, just have a look at the layers on here, there's a a little button there called layer walk. It's a very very um, simple thing to use. So first of all it tells you how many layers we've got. The box can be stretched out as well. So all you need to do is click on each individual layer and it will tell you what is on what layer. So simple yet so powerful. If you hold your control key down you can pick more than one layer as well and if if you hold your shift key down you can pick all of them in between it like so but so if we look at the dimensions layer there so we'll see yeah the dimensions there's nothing else on that layer but if I click on the viewports layer we'll see though we've got a dimension on that layer so if I press close now it'll go back to normal if I just do that one again though so layer walk on the viewports. If I take off this restore on exit, if I press close now, it will actually just leave me on that layer. So I could select that and then go and put that back onto the right layer. So that should be on the dimensions layer. And then put all my layers back on. Nice simple way of doing that. Go to layer walk, hold your shift key down, put restore and exit on. Press continue and those layers back on. It's a really simple way of doing it and it's a really powerful tool. I hope you get to use it soon. Thank you very much and goodbye.